All right. Hello, YouTube. Welcome back to my low rank through Master Rank with Sword and Shield playthrough. Last time we started Master Rank, I've actually managed to not get everything I need for any of my pieces of armor or the weapon that I should be able to get. Um, to make anything that's actually Master Rank, but we're going to work on being able to get everything else because I don't do uh, repeat hunts in these parts because there's enough already per uh, series. So in this part, I'm going to try hunt Aknasom, Legombi, maybe Mizutsune and Rathalos. Maybe. Definitely not Gore and Astalos yet, though. Definitely not. Um, beyond that, no clue. Let's start off with Legombi, I guess. Um, oh yeah, last part, I, uh, discovered that, yeah, these, these change per thing, which means I have to go through and change the switch skill on all of these to this. Because, man, that feels so much better. So I'm going to go ahead and do that real quick. I have, like, no reason to switch my scrolls right now, though. So. Okay, yeah. Sorry about this. Okay. Oh. That's nice. Was this? Yeah, it was. Okay. Just definitely want to make sure I don't overwrite, you know, something I want to, you know, keep separate. Okay. So they should all have twin blade combo now. Yeah. Cool. Okay. So, let go and be fire, right? Fire, yep, okay. Let's go with fire. And while I am queuing up this hunt, I'll ask that if you watch this on YouTube and you end up enjoying, uh, like and subscribe. If you wanna hang out live uh, when I'm doing these, do these every Monday, Wednesday, Friday at 7.30 Eastern over on Twitch. Link is in the description. Come on by, hang out, have a good time. Hello. Um. Aura? Should I just call you Aura? Or Chandler? Whichever. But hope you're having a good one. Aura is good. Okay. But, uh, alright. Legombi. Legombi. There's Legombi. The shop and not mispronouncing it. How else would how else would you pronounce it? I'm actually confused. I guess Miss Red is Aurora. But Oh okay. I mean, I guess if you read a lot of names real quick, I could definitely see it. I don't... I don't actually get people coming in here very often, so, you know. I kind of try to read every name I can relatively well. I guess or isn't a very common word. Well, okay, see? I'm a Dragon Ball fan. So, aura is a common word in my vocabulary, <laughs> so, um, yeah. And I should mention I do have a mod that makes it so max potions max out my health. So, in case you're wondering what that was about.
Recently made a very goofy sword and shield. Build. Oh boy. Like I I've played. Okay, I can't really say I haven't played a lot of sword and shield by this point. Compared to a lot of people, I haven't played a lot. But I I know sword and shield. Minus the final two switch skills I don't have anyway. It's a windmill spam status build with a set. F okay. Okay. I mean, I'm running elemental, so, Grain, I don't know, like, the math on, like, how status works. Well, that's convenient. Like, I don't know the math behind it or anything, but... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fair. Boom. Hey, that actually hit on like Arzaros. Oh. Okay. Or swap out status for elemental. But I like running status because it's also support build. Yeah, it makes sense. Well, it's para or sleep. Yeah. Th that makes sense. I mean, there's a reason that, like, if you give, you know, if you care about what your palicos have, you give them status weapons. There's a reason. <laughs> status is just so good. Like, one proc can open up so much damage, so... Makes sense. You know? I'll be honest, I don't play much multiplayer. Actually, have I ever... I don't think about it. I don't even know if I've ever played Monster Hunter multiplayer. It's basically a completely solo game for me. See, Bill's horrible these days with rain. Okay. Okay, yeah. Elements is better end game because there's. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. I'm just like you know, status just can open up so much, so many possibilities. Yeah, para with randoms is a lot. I could definitely see being a lot more useful than sleep. Uh, what monster isn't para good on in this game? Or monsters, I should say. Because I have no clue. Because I don't usually look at the status parts of those. Like, I have no clue. Like, Narwa, probably? Oh, okay, you don't actually... Okay, that's fair. You probably checked right before your hunt, so... You know, as you should. <laughs> that was nice having dedicated poison build for Kushala. Or you could... You know what a better option is? Not hunting Kushala. Granted, it's nowhere near as bad as before. As it... Like... Kushala is way more manageable in this game, but my god. Okay. You always do two in Master Rank. Is that how that works? That was... You know what? Sure. It worked as a dodge. Yep, that was my... That was my plan. Mm-hmm. Yep. I love whiffing. Okay. It's 
just gonna... Can I get a one swipe? Nope, two? No? Okay. Like using Glaive on Kushala. Yeah. Really showed who really owns this guy, you know? <laughs> yeah, no, that makes sense. Hmm, I thought I got the counter off. I did not. Okay. You couldn't? Oh. I thought he let go of the thing. Nope, it just was able to reach that far. Damn wire bug, why you gotta be so stretchy then? What the hell? You play everything except heavy bowgun? Makes sense. Yeah, using particular weapons on monsters. I, I mean, I main dual blades, but this is like, this is the first weapon that I'm gonna go through and play through the game with every monster, with every weapon. So, like, I use, I can use every weapon, well, eventually anyway. I don't know how, you know, the other third, well, other 12 weapons work and rise as much. But I'm a dual blades main normally. I just, I like, I like, like, learning things in games, so. Okay, that was, that was good. I like that. There's a reason I keep you around, Chives. There's a reason. That's a pretty damn good one. <laughs> you mean Charge Blade and Dual Blades? It's a nice pair. Oh yeah, they do. Right, Charge Blade is very, like, isn't it very elemental in this game? Or, like, has insane potential for elemental builds? I don't know why yet. I haven't played it. What? Only played a world charge blade. <clears throat> what? It does how much? Oh, okay. So, um, I no longer need to ask why, um, why it's good. I don't know. Is that what they... I don't know. You're asking the wrong person. <laughs> I have no idea what they call it. <laughs> Ah, the Arzuros. Nice. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, that's nice. Nice. I'm actually gonna go with the head here then. Oh, that was quick. Okay, are you talking about the one with that uses all of your files? Because last I knew that was SAED. That, that last I knew. If they're calling it something different now, I don't know. Granted, I'm terrible with move names. Like, I still don't know what the name for the longsword, like, you know, ultimate anime move is that you, you know, you slice down and then you have, like, the eight hits or whatever afterwards. Whether it's Helmbreaker, Helm Split, or some other thing. I still don't know what that's called. So... Move names, not my forte, to say the least. Spirit Helmbreaker, okay. Okay, good to know.
That don't look like sword and shield only. What do you mean? It's got a sword tail scythe thing. Don't ask me about other monsters though. I can't I, I got nothing for them though. Um Okay. Nice, there he goes. It is, in fact, over. Grey feels more like Longsword. Yeah. But isn't... Isn't Sacred Sheath the... The, um... Switch skill that basically lets you charge, like, Greatsword? Can't figure it. Longsword out, save it. It longsword, you're at least in world, you played a different game. <laughs> and longsword is got so because you know I had to play through the entire game with that. Well, I didn't have to, but I played through a world with every weapon, right? After the longsword playthrough, I forget what I used. I forget what weapon it was. But I was so in the mind of counter everything. <laughs> like, it's a different game. Just, uh, so it took a while to, I probably finished low rank before I even got out of that mindset. This game is great for you, yep. Yeah. Because most, we oh, I know that. I mean, I, I like, I pretty much like every Monster Hunter game. Granted, the new ones I like more because they feel a lot more responsive. As, you know, that's kind of how, you know, games, newer games should be. But, like, I'm not going to say one is better than the other. I personally like World better. But I think Rise, is ju it's just a different game. Like playing, you've been playing dual blades, your counter skills are not. I mean, dual blade, I like the counter for dual blades. And you've only played Rise so far, huh? I would highly recommend World. Then, if like you ever get the chance to play it. I mean, assuming you're like interested anyway. Because it is such a good game. Oh yeah, it is active for so long. You know what's even better about it? You can use it combined with Dual Blade's uh, sharpness one. The sharpness uh, switch skill. Because all you need is iframes. So you just do the uh, Dual Blade's counter while you have that active and boom, you just gain sharpness for countering. World was a big change for me. I really didn't care for... No, you didn't care for World? Hmm. I mean, to each their own. If you didn't like it, fair enough. Is that how my bill set? I can't run... No? You can't run Iron Shine? No? Well, I'm assuming you probably need whatever other Switch skills in that slot. You never played World either? Wow. I mean, like like I told them, I'd recommend it if you ever get the chance. It is... Pro no, I don't think it's number one still for, like, all time for me. I think it's definitely top three. But... It's definitely one of my top three favorite games of all time. Locked in Red School for most of the hunt. Oh yeah, I forgot that there... 
I didn't change my build much after, like, Silver Athelos came out. So... I remember, like, nothing of... Um... The later... Like, any of the later switch... Like, not switch skills, uh... Armor skills. Like... <laughs> But I forgot that they made ones where, uh, like, it depends what scroll you're in. Oh. And all I know is, uh, I don't know, I like them both. So, you know. I think you just have, like, because I'm sure... You've seen the, like, no Rise is a shit game, world is better, or world is a shit game, Rise is better debate. And it's like, no, they're both good games. They're just different games. You can't expect the same thing from both of them. Most of you get your dual blades armor from might not have existed when you were last that far in. I mean, like, I I basically went from Rathalos to Silver Rathalos. Like, that's basically my armor progression, <laughs> so. And then I just stuck with Silver Rathalos for the rest of the updates and everything. Okay, so, well, the updates existed. I basically got my Rathalos armor. Didn't play until all of the title updates were done. And then I did everything. Like hunted primordial, all that stuff. And yeah. What are the Matsu prison Valstrax? Yeah, I did. I forget what... What is it with Valstrax that's like... Oh, I didn't get that counter, huh? I forget what it is with the Valstrax that like makes it... Cause doesn't, doesn't the Matsu just make your like switch skills just better? Oh yeah, you have that backflip, right. I forgot about that. One red school converts. Oh yeah, that's the master rank one, right? Oh. Okay, you're... that's fine. I appreciate you coming by. Hope you have a good one. It's always fun having people in here. Don't have in people in here very often, sadly, but you know, is what it is. That's why you play a game you have a good time with, so. Yeah, I remember they made... I didn't sh I know what armor it was, but that's a Matsu that gives you, like, infinite sharpness and stamina. Okay. I will say, the one thing I think... I think Ryze went a little too far in the, like... In the Hunter's strength. Personally. I think they went a little too far. It's a giant pain to build, but... I'm- I'm sure. Yeah. But I, d I do think Rise went a little far when it comes to player strength. Because you can get a little out of control. But... I mean, like, they went all in on it in this game, and I think that, you know... If you're gonna go for it, go all in, you know? And bullet barrage. Oh god. Ah. Uh, yep. Yep. Gun Lance is was the big surprise for World when I played through with every weapon. Well, actually Lance and Gun Lance. Cause Lance and Gun Lance are literally 
number two and three favorites for me. Like, from World. So. Yeah, I know, right? It's, they're, I mean, even Lance is, Lance is even simpler. But I find them both very fun. Well, okay. What kind of, I'm assuming normal shelling gun lance? I would assume so. Oh, apparently I needed that. Gun splitter for shelling. Oh, does bullet barrage not, like, matter for... I don't know, it's been a while, I don't know. Oh, Amatsu's long? Oh, man. So that's worth it, then, to lose out on the extra... What? Two shells? Like, that's worth it, then? I don't know how big the Amatsu boost is. Also gets more damage. I guess that makes sense. Um, I guess since you played Gunlance, um... I'm curious, because it was a little annoying. Oh, it's 10%. Yeah, that is pretty. But, uh, in World, it was kind of annoying to consistently land uh, the worm stake in a monster. How's it like in this game? Oh, oh my. <laughs> that looked funky as hell. <laughs> oh, okay. But yeah, like, because the most consistent way I found in World to land, uh, well, god damn it, I forgot how short time you have, but, okay, it's a pain, you have a erupting cannon, which is faster, okay, I don't really know what that does exactly, but, okay, Sounds good to me. Because the only consistent way I found in World to land uh, the Worm Stake was actually a uh, uh, Glider Mantle. You, like, Glider Mantle. You Clutch Claw on, jump off, and then you'll glide long enough to then do a full burst into Wormstake before they can recover if they, uh, had the Clagger. You can just... I am on PC, but... Eh. I mean, like, I'll... I, I like learning it on my own when I, like, when I get to it in the... Whenever I get to Gunlance. Sadly, it's gonna be a long time, because... I'm playing weapons in the order I liked them in World, so... And this is the first one. Now, I didn't hate- I, hadn't, I didn't hate Sword and Shield. It was just the least liked. Because Perfect Rush was satisfying. It just was over-centralizing. But, like, you know, still, like, was a solid, like, 7.58 out of 10, in my opinion, but. Appreciate offering the help, though. But. Because, like, for, uh, Windmill is really funny because it has 100 fr- Huh? It has what? 100 frames of advent- What? Wait, what? Wait, is... What is Windmill? Is it a Master Rank Switch skill? Because if it is, I haven't actually used it yet. I'll have to double check when I can use that, but... It's one of the ones you start with? Oh, okay. I guess then I just didn't like it. Okay.
Because that was, like... Probably months ago at this point. Okay. Oh. How did that not hit me? Most people use Metsu, but Windmill seems like the best option, specifically for a status build. Okay. I don't know. I mean, you sound like you know a hell of a lot more about set building than I do. So. <laughs> I never get too into it. Like I like I like making a build, but I don't like get you know deep into like the woods of stuff or anything. They do. You build all your own sets. Yeah. Okay. I mean, that is part of the fun. Like, I just don't, you know, I don't get, like, super deep into it. Like, I don't, I guess it's like, I make my build, I don't optimize it. Really. If that makes sense. Am I getting a bit into the woods on this? Want to try a turbo optimize? Okay. Yeah, like, I definitely don't optimize things, because, like, I played both Lance and Gun Lance Guard 5. Like, like, I know you don't need to do that. I didn't care what monster it was. Guard 5, Guard Up, didn't care. Usually my build process is this place out fun and build around that. Fair enough, yeah. That's pretty much what, what I do. You just seem to kind of get more into the build than I do. Granted, I am also, you know, playing through the game where, in a way, where I have to play through it 14 different times. So, I am less inclined to farm. <laughs> So, yeah, there is that. Your SNS build specifically started off as I want to have a better support build. Fair. If you're not going to play Hunting Horn and, like, buff a, like, well, support with buffs. Sword and Shield is, I would say, on par, if not actually just straight up better. Because you can just heal on, like, need. Because you don't even need to put your weapon away or anything. I missed it again, huh? I'm really not good at count. Well, that wasn't necessary. You were just going through. God damn. That wasn't nice. Jeez. The heck, man. What did he do to you? So then I'll still need to work on your horn build. Oh. Leaning into element, really. Hmm. Okay. But yeah, I feel like that's probably why we're, like, why we get in building a bit differently. It's because I have to play through, like, because of what I'm doing, I'm playing through the game 14 different times. So, less farming is just good for me. For my sanity.
Because, like, I'd get rid of everything. Yeah, see, yeah, you're approaching 900 hours in a single playthrough, and... Yeah. Yeah. So, that that's probably what it is, is, you know... You're more committed to doing one specific thing versus I'm literally restarting. Okay, that works, I guess. Fair. I thought I was going to stay down. Cool. And you're, you're slow. Okay. Fair enough. That's how it goes sometimes. I'll be a hundred percent sure. I'm not even sure if that link works. <laughs> I think it should. I don't know if you were planning on going to it or not, but Ugh. all right. Yeah, I don't care about the wake up. Probably should, but it's Acnesom. It's not like it's, you know, a Gormagala or something that could like kill me real quick. You can, you know, I don't know why I've never thought about that. I always do, uh, it's decent enough, that, yeah, I always do this, like, I always do that, never thought about doing Metsu, well, I never thought about doing that, that, that seems so much better and easy, uh, and possibly will lead into just a KO. I mean, yeah, I figured, I figured it's, that's probably a decent option too, but for some reason, I just never thought, just walk up and just, you know, just uppercut the rest. Since it's a Capcom game, I can make the joke of, uh, man, it really, um, changes the meaning to a wake up, uh, DP. If you know fighting games, you get it. Wake up DP, motherfucker. <laughs> uh. Except I'm not the one waking up. Does that count as Oki? Does it? Does going to sleep count? As Oki. I mean, would like in like say Street Fighter Four or something like would or like at the past Street Fighter games, punishing the wake up, punishing the wake up, yeah, maybe, but would sleep count as Oki? This is a question that nobody's had before. <laughs> eh, eh. Nothing great. Is what it is. Because, like, if you equate it to stun, did people consider stun Oki? Because I feel like not really. So, hmm. Sure, whatever. Whatever. 
deal with that. Oh my, I haven't picked the stuff in a, up in a while, apparently. I can probably do this now. Yeah, I don't want to though. Alright. Sure. Sure. It's like over the motion value spreadsheet. That's actually just the best single hit you have. Really? Like the first hit is just better. I guess thinking about it, well, because it's only the, well, I'm just asking because, like, the first hit is, you know, the one that gets the double damage. At least I assume the whole thing doesn't get doubled. That'd be broken. But. Yeah. But, like, the first hit. You know what? Oh, I can't do it here. Never mind. That would have been convenient if I could have done it there. But I'm not going to go to the training area just to test that. But. Like, I feel like it's just close enough to the point where I might as well just start doing that. Because, like I said, I never even thought about just waking, like, doing a wake-up hit with Shorigeki. If you got the game, you can get counter Metsu off a small barrel bomb. Yeah, no. What? Okay. That's a big no for me. When I played Great Sword and World, you want to know how many times I failed to wake up with True Charge Slash? And then do you want to know how many times I hit them, waking them up, more than I didn't fail. <laughs> so, yeah, so I stopped bothering with it and I just did a full first hit charge. I was like, screw it, I'm not dealing with it. Eventually I did switch to doing the second hit. Like, I missed the first one, then did the second one. Oh, you're on Surge Slash, okay. I'd... Oh, that seems weird, but I don't know. I have no clue. Um, okay, what do we... Uh, I need to mark off Agnesom before I forget. This... It's the fast way to charge combo. Oh, really? Okay. Hmm. Oh! I didn't even see that. I can make Lugombi legs. I don't think I want to right now. I would assume so. I mean... I have all the critical element decorations, but I think I would be losing full crit. Yeah, I'd be losing full crit. That's 10%, that last level. So I'll make it and save it. it does do more defense, though. So for now, I'll wait. Oh, really? I'll be honest. I never... In world, I never did uh, the SAED for the sole reason is I always I always missed them, so I only ever did the like single file one. I played Charge Blade really weird, where like I played it like it was elemental, but I didn't use elemental. Although it was solely because getting a stun, getting like a stun off of a, off of a guard point is just so satisfying. Like, 
that is something else. Um, okay, so... Do I go for Mizutsune? Because I can get... I feel like I want to go for Fire. But that also, I don't feel comfortable with Rathalos right now. Because Rathalos could probably one-shot me with a lot of stuff. There's unfortunately no reason to ever run Impact in this game. That's sad. That's unfortunate. Hmm. I'm definitely not going after Astalos, right? Or Gore. So... I feel like anything that is going to be weak to ice probably is still weak to water. But anything that resists ice is probably also going to resist water. But I don't want to fight Rathalos right now. So... I'm still going to fight Mizutsune. Well enough during progression or falls off super hard end game. I mean, I'm not gonna like do you know anomaly stuff or anything. It's what is considered end game in this game? Cause I feel like there's kind of a more clear Cause like in world, I feel like you could say it's just raging Brachidios was the end of the regular game. Cause you have Safi, Alatrion, Fatalis. I know you didn't end up playing it, but um But uh yeah, because like that's kinda like its own progression. You just went one to the next into the next. But in this it's like I have no clue. I want to say that's my best one right now, anyway. So, yeah, okay. Like, it's kind of a couple stages you go through in post game, yeah. So, like, it's kind of weird. <laughs> Is Mizu's a three? Is it a four? It's a four, isn't it? Or that? Oh god. I want to try it. <laughs> this is a four, right? Yeah. So I can use one follower. It's going to be Minoto. Just working through the MR urgence, working through anomaly rank, yeah. I never really did, like, I never did actual anomaly grinding. Like, I leveled my stuff up somewhat. Like, I just hunted the same thing over and over, listening to music, basically. I wasn't playing the game. Itsuchi has horn. I've really never looked at it. I just used both of them. Like, both of the sisters. I just have them both on horn. Oh yeah, he does have everything, doesn't he? Hmm, I might have to look at that. I never... I actually don't think I've ever looked at what... Like, horns they all have. Are those the only horns? Actually, I have no clue. Uh, so you also go with the double horn? Okay. Also, in case you didn't notice, I used the... I used the, um, 
a max potion to max my health because I have a mod that lets me do that because I think that's what they should have done in the first place. Or there should have been some consumable to do that. Let me finish my drink. I should have done it beforehand, but... Let me finish my drink. I'm getting drunk here. Cool, okay, let's actually do this. God, this is gonna be terrible with garbage sharpness. Damn it, Zenogre. Why don't you have good sharpness? Let's run one that gives me Rainbow Bird. See, I would do that, but, it, like, I feel like that's too cheaty. Because, like, I still have to do something to get it. Granted, you're not making content for the game, so, you know. I just feel like I want to ignore... Sharpness could be worse. Yeah. True. But, uh... Yeah, like... Because, like, I felt like I wanted to ignore having to deal with the... Oh, you're cheating. You're not good at the game at all. Because you, you're cheating. And it's like... It's letting me do the actually interesting part. Like, so... Because, like, this just goes on YouTube, so... You know what? I oh, goddamn it. Wrong button. Oh. So there's another one of those in this game, huh? I discovered in, uh, World... Because I did a random loadout playthrough in World. There was a, um... There was a... High rank... I think it was also bad in, uh... In Master Rank as well. But there was a high rank sword that... Oh, it wasn't good in any... What I'm about to talk about, it was not good in any way. But it, it, um, it had about, like, two hits. Oh, actually, no. Never mind. I'm giving it too much credit. It didn't even have green sharpness. Like, it literally had only yellow sharpness. It was a high rank weapon. All I'm gonna say is thank god I got longsword for that hunt. Because that hunt was a Zerathalos and you bounce off of it everywhere. So if, it, if I didn't get longsword that would have been the most miserable hunt ever. It still was not great. But yeah I think that that's the worst weapon I've seen. Because at least 100% affinity... Hey, go get, um, Master's Touch. You might actually get a use out of it then. But, like, the one I'm talking about, I had Yellow Sharpness. Like, that that's just not usable. <laughs> Okay. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, that was the bubble. I'm playing with fire. I need to remember this thing is, uh... Yeah, that's exactly why I healed. <laughs> this thing is, um, way above what I should be hunting right now. I need to remember that. Because I still don't have... That was lucky. Because I'm not using any Master Rank gear yet. 
And I'm hunting a Mizutsune, because I'm stupid. Can't actually... Oh, you really can't look at what specific... Oh, that's dumb. That's kind of... I guess, to be fair, the only thing that matters about is... Or matters. This might kill me. Never mind, we're fine. Can I... Oh, my weapon's put away? Question mark? But... Hunting Horn, I guess, is the only weapon that that would matter for. But then again, what other weapon are you more likely... Most likely to use... When you can get followers? Uh, camera? I, I'd like to see... <laughs> it matters for the rain. Oh yeah, I guess it would, yeah. Yeah. I kind of forgot that you can get ranged weapon followers. Because I've only ever used Hunting Horn. Well, other than the follower quests to get them and stuff, but... Okay. I'll be honest, I'm surprised I don't get, like, one shot by stuff at this point. Because, like, this is, you know... This is a four-star monster. I would have thought I would, like, die instantly. Jay is a disgrace to chart. Oh, really? Is he? Should I even at... Why did I think standing there was a good idea? I knew he was there. Did I really? Okay. I really just got, um... Paralyzed twice by the monster I'm not even hunting. been better like a few seconds ago but runs condensed spinning slash with impact files condensed spinning slash I don't know what these switch skills are you need to remember I have only at this point really played dual blades and sword and shield oh so it still has it still has axe mode it's just, it's a switch skill, then? Is that it? Or is just regular Savage Axe mode still a thing? Because I know they added that in Iceborne. Okay, okay, so it's Charged Sword or Savage Axe, basically. Because Savage Axe was like the buzz saw. Oh, hello. Because that's what it was in World, it was Savage Axe. So it's Charged Sword or, or, uh, or Savage Axe. You're not very good at this. There you go. Took you a while. I don't feel like attacking and then not being able to do anything once you move like so. There we go. Okay. I guess that's... I actually like that. Because I feel like... You could probably, if they change that, you know, you can make a full build off of that. 
How did that not hit me for so long? Is she really better than the average random at wyvern riding? Are they that bad? Like, are they really? Whoops. If you want to actively steal, try to steal your ride, only to do much worse than you could. Oh. Like, how, how are randoms that bad on, like, online? Oh. I have the fun buff. It might actually be a D buff, but I call it the fun buff. Because it buffs the fun. I mean, like, that's just funny, man. Bubble Blade is just... It's just so funny, man. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> it's so stupid. Oh, man. You've never seen a single ram do a dot? Mess with a bubbly dance? No, I have not. I've st I've thought about it. I've just never tried it. Also, really? They've never dodge canceled? Like, you don't see them dodge cancel? How? It literally lights up green to dodge when you do an attack. Like, the game literally tells you, hey, dodge. It might, you know, do something. Otherwise, why would we be green right now? I mean, yeah, the tutorial might not teach you, but the UI literally goes green right there. <laughs> And it only happens when you've attacked. So... I just randomly really... Tr try really hard to take the wyvern ride. Really? I thought it was like best to not even do a wyvern ride. Although that might be like solo. Maybe. Like that might be a solo only thing. I got up at the wrong time. Eh, that wasn't terrible to block. I've blocked worse. I've blocked Rajang and World. That'll like one shot you while blocking. I mean, this hunt will probably take a little bit, but. good to know that I can do it even without like having my armor nice I actually got the tail boom if you know if you say that I have a gold oh uh, doesn't gold get you more materials? Right? I think that's what that does. And red makes the Punisher better. Like, that definitely should be like, oh, they definitely get the Wyvern ride. I mean, that's just logic. Wait, what? There's no way they're ready for capture. There's no way. Seriously? Already? I expected, wait, no. I, I won't believe it until I see Blue Skull. Okay, well, there's Blue Skull. <laughs> um. Wow. I'm shocked. Because this is a high rank weapon, like, I would expect that to be a lot longer. Huh. 
Huh. Okay. I guess to be fair, I'd have a... Well, no, that would, would still be affected by raw. So, I was gonna say, like, I do do a lot of shield stuff, but, like, that's still affected by raw. Okay. 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 Boom. Nice. I'm shocked at. In a matter of seconds. I get it. Um, I'm really shocked at the fact that I was that I can get under twenty with the high rank weapon on Mizutsune. <laughs> if I remember right, Mizutsune was my first triple cart in my original playthrough, and so. Although, I guess then again, well, uh, that was my first Moss Hunter game. That's always the hardest. Because <laughs> I was going to say, well, Anjanath in World is, was the first thing that triple carded me. But it was my first Moss Hunter game. Which is always your hardest. That is just a fact. I hope I was a help and not a hindrance. Yes. All right. Now, I assume I can't make it, because I'd never get enough stuff. I definitely need to look at getting a gatherer. Only types. Alright. Okay. Okay. Three max potions. Sure. Alright, what we got? <laughs> hey. I could try it out now. If I wanted to. But... So... Increase evasiveness. Oh, inflicts a bubble blight. What the hell is bubble blight due to monsters? I have no clue. That sounds interesting, though. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. That was just full slugger. Almost didn't catch that. Not that I'm gonna use it right away, but okay, so we have we can get everything to get our armor. I can get this. I can't get Yeah, no, because that's Elder Dragon. That's just okay. Um I could hunt a T-Rex, so I could get this. Although, T-Rex hurts a lot, hits a lot harder, just because it's T-Rex, so probably not. I think I just hunt something, like, low tier. Uh, let's see... Let's not. Uh, oh. No, oh, is there anything? Gotta learn how to actually play this game without using dual blades. It's tough. You gotta change your mindset. 
a lot to be able to like just entirely change the like if you played only one weapon um you know what it's actually like hunt the monster that you start um master rank on if i can find it hello I mean, there's Shogun. Oh, there it is. Thunder, huh? Okay. Mine says horrible. I mean... It... So... Like, my last playthrough that I did in World... It was random loadouts. That included the weapon. So I had to juggle all 14 weapons. Like in their like move sets going back and forth. Trust me. I know how hard it is to change like the mindset around using a weapon. Oh that's capture. I ain't capturing shit. But trust me, I know. It is not easy. Don't see how you guys dodge some of these monsters. Oh, some of these monsters go crazy. They do. They definitely do. I definitely don't have a follower for this one. Um... I mean, I'll be honest, before I got my counter for Sword and Shield, I felt like I couldn't do anything. Because I just felt like I just, well, I attacked and now I'm going to get hit. So, like in Rise, let's just say there's a reason every weapon has a counter. But also every weapon having a counter is why monsters are the way they are. But I mean, the hardest thing in Monster Hunter, in my opinion, is finding the balance of offense and defense. That you need to do to like I mean to more feel like you're playing well enough to yourself let's see if I remember how to fight you like at all I probably don't need to slow down your mindset want everything to be fast yep yep I understand that. Oh, trust me, I understand that. Oh yeah, that's a move. Right. I forgot about that. Oh. You do that, huh? I remember, like, nothing about you. Because I've never needed to hunt you. Oh, I forgot about my max potion. Whoops. Fix that. Fair. But I mean, like... It's not gonna be easy. I will just tell you that right now. Fair. Get fucked. Ah. I wasn't sure how to do that, honestly. 
Probably should have just went right down so I could do more perfect rush. Alright, what do you do here again? Do you- yeah, okay, that's what I thought. Oh, it's a grab? Have I never been hit by this before? I might have never been hit by that before. Oh, right. Master ranks where they really start the combos. Right. Ah. Why? Okay. Okay, cool. It's fine with me. Did you just put down the You did just put down the tree. Why? Alright. This game work the same as World, where you can only get hit by moves once. I love the little celebrations. It's just so funny. I don't know if that should hit me. Okay, so I'm not blocking now. Okay, so I think it does work that way. Where you can only get hit once per attack if you block it. Thank you. Ah. Fair. Alright, I need to sharpen. Can I get a one swipe? That'd be great. Nope, two. Okay, two. Yeah. 
Boom. Oh. Okay. Boom. Okay, that does hit the shill. Sadly. That's some good stuff right there. Aha! Get dodged. Ow. No. Okay, well, you got that one. Okay. on that one. Okay. Almost. Oh. That... You know, you could probably get rid of the shell. That might be a little easier, but okay. What do I know? I'm not a crab. I do know. It's annoying to get back to him. I'm just gonna go there. All right, I'm gonna actually do what I just learned. I could, I should probably have done like way before. Okay, that's good damage. Okay, you know what? Yeah, it's a good option. Not bad. Not bad. It was fun. Ugh. Okay. Alright. That was fun. A mark off. Um, where you at? There it is. All right. Cool. Hey there. All right. Yeah. It's not terrible. Thank you for your patronage. All right. So, not bad. Um, so I will between this and next part I'll have all my armor. Maybe upgrade, I don't know. I don't know how much that costs. And I mean, Master Rank's actually going to cost a lot. I probably won't upgrade it until I get to my final set. 
honestly. I don't know. But I'll have my armor. I'll have this. No, not this. Uh, this. I won't have this. Um, I'll have this. So I'll have my ice and water weapons for Master Rank. And then at that point, I'll also have my armor. I'll probably think of a like mid Master Rank set. Work towards that as well as getting my Rathalos Master Rank as well as hunting Astalos at one point. And then Gore. Which, considering Gore and Mizutsune are in the same tier, that's probably not that far off. I also need to look at Rampage skills. I don't know what I'm looking at for what I can make there. But uh, either way, that is going to do it for this one. So if you watch this on YouTube, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, like, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And I will see you next time. See ya.